Just another example of NASA faking space. Let's take a look here at this supposed image of Jupiter. Nothing more than CGI fakery. The supposed auroras towards the north. Let's take a look here. Again at NASA's official website where it states Hubble captures vivid auroras in Jupiter's atmosphere. Here's the problem. The date of June 30th, 2016. Now take a look at this. Another so-called official image of Jupiter. This one's from back in 2014. You see the problem here? Now let's take a closer look at the supposed two images provided from NASA of Jupiter. Here's the problem again. 2016, 2014. What's the difference here? The well, difference is they added the supposed auroras on the north. I mean, this is nothing but a Christmas tree. Give me a break. Take a look here. I mean, all the clouds are in the same exact position. Just the 2016 image is a bit, I would say, darker. This is a bit lighter in 2014. Here's a side-by-side. -side. I mean, people can't see what's taking place here with NASA. Nothing more than fakery. I mean, give me a break. This is, com this is a complete insult. If you have a brain in your head, the supposed clouds moving at the speeds they supposedly do, and they get the same exact image from two years apart. Not possible. Now, as always, how NASA loves to mock, just like I showed before, with the supposed image of the blue marble, and I'll get into that in a little bit, with the occult of the blue marble, the name itself. Take a look here. This is an unedited image of the supposed blue marble. And what do you see here? As I shown before, it says sex in the clouds. Let's get a closer look at, at this. Clearly see it says sex in the clouds. This is the way they love to mock. And I'll get into that with the sex symbolism when it comes to NASA and Disney. I'm getting back to the image, again, supposedly of Jupiter from 2016. So they took a look, again, just like the blue marble, there's always hidden messages and with NASA, of course, being a government agency, it's all about mockery once again. Take a look here at this closer image. You can see some writing again in these clouds. It looks like Khan. You almost see an angelic image here. Let's take a closer look. Not quite sure to make out, but I definitely see Khan. Can't really make out what it says here. And again, the angelic image. Understand, once you understand this is nothing but fakery, then you're going to see what's taking place here where they're... They're intentionally putting these hidden messages in. I see, again, more more of a con job. That's all it is. And that's why they put that con in there. Now, understand what's taking place with the deep deception that's taking place in this world with NASA.